Can you recognize this well-known sign? The answer is definitely yes. It's McDonald's, the biggest fast food shop in the whole world. Let's discover what's going on in McDonald's. McDonald's is the largest quick service restaurant organization in the world. McDonald's Restaurants Hong Kong Limited was established in 1975. The first McDonald's restaurant was located at Patterson Street in Causeway Bay. Today, there are over 200 McDonald's restaurants in Hong Kong. Among them, there are 64 24 hours McDonald's restaurants. There are more than 10,000 McDonald's staff. In addition, McDonald's also opened a cafe in Hong Kong in a bid to meet the needs of different customers. Every year, each McDonald's restaurant makes transactions for more than 600,000 times, more than the U.S. does by 400,000 times. Each McDonald's makes a turnover of 15 million Hong Kong dollars. Having 210 McDonald's in Hong Kong means that the total turnover will be 3.1 billion Hong Kong dollars. How often do you have dinner with your family? Do you remember your parents' birthday? When was the last time you met? Okay. Uh, do you know McDonald's has classified the ketchup into different levels of sour taste? No. Okay. You know McDonald's has classified the ketchup into different sour taste, with a level of sour taste. No. The answer is twelve. There are altogether twelve different flavors of ketchup, classified according to the level of sourness, varying from one to twelve. If your answer is wrong, never mind. Even most of the McDonald's crews in Hong Kong do not know. Although some of them may know, they are not very keen on providing this service as they are simply too busy, and the customers as well. That's why they don't ask for a particular sourness of ketchup. They go there because they are hungry. They do not care about the taste of the food, whether the food is healthy or not. They just want to finish their meals as soon as possible so they can resume their work earlier. Hong Kong people are really in great hurry. Let's see how long they will stay in McDonald's. According to a research, Hong Kong people will leave McDonald's. Thirty minutes in average after they enter it. Assume that everyone buys a medium meal. You have to find a seat, finish a cup of soft drinks, a hamburger, a pack of medium-sized French fries within thirty minutes. Look, they all leave the rubbish on the tables. Unlike Hong Kong people, most Westerners clean up the table themselves after the meal. It suggests how busy Hong Kong people are. Hong Kong people are not only busy at work, but also restless at night. They have higher and higher demand for 24-hour services. Therefore, recently, McDonald's in Hong Kong has provided 24-hour services, so people can buy food from McDonald's anytime they want. It seems that it benefits the busy, restless Hong Kong people. However, they may have forgotten something because of their busyness. From the above investigation about the behavior of the customers of McDonald's in Hong Kong, we can see that they have forgotten some tiny little things like the taste of food, their own health, and so on. How about you? What else have you forgotten? How often do you have dinner with your family? Do you remember your parents' birthday? <laughs> When was the last time you met your friends face to face? But not using MSN or chat room.
Have you forgotten the beautiful natural scenery in Hong Kong? Have you ever visited the famous historical relics? How about the democracy we are asking for? Do you care about the political situation in Hong Kong now? Those are things that we should pay attention to.